I'm getting ready to head in the woods and do some relic hunting. It's my first hunt this season. On the highway. Today I got the uh, the AT Max. I don't have my damn reading glasses. I can't hardly see any of this. Do we want to hunt in zero mode or all metal mode? Uh, I'm cranking the sensitivity up. Threshold. I do like to have a little threshold. I like that buzz. Uh, iron disc. Uh, we might run it up to maybe 10 we're gonna run uh, all metal god iron audio all metal mode iron audio on let's try that guy uh maybe not oh let me run this thing on zero there we go yeah it's a little more quiet put a little bit more threshold in this thing yeah we'll put two it's something down there Down there pretty good. It's pretty deep. Well, that's one of the bad things about hunting relics alongside a highway. Nah. We got something itty bitty. Itty bitty, itty bitty. Tiny little thing. I don't know if it's a button or a tack. What is it? It's probably a tack. Yeah. Yeah, I think it's a saddle tack. Wait a minute. No, maybe not. It's got something on it, doesn't it? We found a little bit of brass. Almost looks like a little eagle. Stick her down in here so nothing happens to it. Keep her safe. So I'm trying to get a little further away from the highway. No more foil, I can't dig any more foil. You wouldn't believe the amount of foil that I've dug from teeny tiny to gobs. It's the first time I've been out hunting relics since last February, I think, or March. And, um, nothing nothing more enjoyable man this is so nice i love october november and december getting out and doing some digging it's the best just the best it's therapeutic um i see something good it looks like brass man i see green i see green oh boy this is the same area where i dug that uh that beautiful green patinaed uh, piece of the saddle but look I, I see a tiny bit of green oh man what uh, is it a oh lord Ooh, what is it it's in rough shape man yeah I can't tell I thought maybe it was a piece to an epaulette. I see more. There's more brass sticking out. And maybe it is an epaulette. Uh, yeah, I think, yep, yeah, it is part of an epaulette. It sure is. It's part of the shoulder scales. Yep.
Now we got a really good bullet signal here. Oh, that's just perfect. I mean, it doesn't get any better than that, really. See what we got. Looks like we got a little pistol bullet. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Is it a Colt? Oh, that's cool, man. We got a bullet. Yay. We got a bullet. Sweet. I'll check out what I just got in my change. I got uh, one of those uh, Abraham Lincoln pennies. You don't see many of these. I think they made four of these, four different styles. They've got Abraham Lincoln chopping wood. They've got, I think, a log cabin. Um, I forget the other ones. I think I have all of them. Seems like every few years I find one in my change. They're not that common. I think they produced them in 2009. But I'm sure collectors scooped them up pretty quick. You just don't see them and change much anymore. I've got a pretty good selection of them. I've actually given some away as gifts to some of my friends. But uh, I still have a few. And I got a wheat penny. <laughs> and that wild. I just, ha I just happened to look at my other pennies and there's a damn wheat penny in there. That's unusual. Two scores in one day.